Well, we're in Port Hope Simpson here now, and uh, later on today we're going to go to Williams Harbor. The first order of business is I'm going to get these rounders to soak. These are uh, uh, dried salt rounders. So I cut the tail off and just cut them in half. And we'll be having rounders. Uh, I'm not sure if we're just going to have rounders and potatoes or rounders and brews or rounders and brews and potatoes, you know, with onions and scrunchions. But anyway, whichever way we're having is going to be a fantastic meal. I'm just going to cut the tail off and just, just basically cut them in half. There. Throw them in the bar. And like always, a good old smell. Oh. That's a half of those rounders, so fine meal. I'm not really sure how many of this is going to be out there. It'll be me, Randall, Boyce, and William is coming with us. And Brother Trev, he might show up. I'm not really sure. He got a few things he got to do here as well. So now, whack the old salt fish off the hands there. Just gotta soak the salt out. That's the seal rocks that sticks off here. That's why we keep well over on this side of the bay. Well, I must say, it is good to be back. Yeah, always good to get back here in Williams Harbor, that's for sure. Yep, hopefully we get a little bit of hunting in, get some work done, maybe pick a few gulls eggs. Get some mussels to roast. Maybe do a little fishing with the rod. You know, there's a lot to do. We mightn't find time enough to do it all, but we're gonna do most of it. No, we gotta need a generator going here in Williams Harbor. This right here is beaver pan, and looks like there was a beaver here. <laughs> yep. There might be a little hoose on over another side, not shorter. One. Got like wheat sky there? That's because there's a lot of ice there and it's moving in. Uh, you know, we wouldn't be able to get back to Mary server if we wanted to now in my honor. There's all, all the ice packed in to land there. 
That's what do you call it? Oist blink. That weak streak there. Seen a seal here uh, yesterday evening, but we didn't get there either shot at him. But uh, we're hoping to harvest some seal. The oyster's in, so later on this evening we're going to go out to the edge of that oyster, have a little hunt. But first we're, we're doing some work with our pots. My first ever mallard. <laughs> yeah, you know, they're, uh, they're moving further north all the time. Now tag on it. Keep going straight down. Yeah. <laughs> Grab the next round, yeah. There you go. You done it. Yay. You're not too easy. Well guys, we got a, a bit of work done there. We hauled down there's actually, you know, there's a nice bit of ice still up under that rope there. So we got some hauled out. We're gonna go for a little hunt and let Mother Nature, you know, milk some of that while we're out harvesting some good old healthy food from the land. What an evening for a seal. It's the fish rock right there. All right, just seen a bearded seal. He was swimming really fast, just around this corner of ice here. It was all heavy ice here, so. Just gonna slow her in now, see where you. He... <laughs> go over there, William, see if any grass, a pile of grass. Please go around with you a little bit. Now. William's looking for gull's eggs. You started? Oh yeah, way much longer. The water's really dark. Yeah. Oh yeah, we got her. Okay, Will, get ready. See the nest is probably made? Yeah. Oh yeah, a little later on you'll get eggs in them same spots. Look at that. Yes sir, ring seals on the menu for supper. It's gonna be a fine eating seal right there and the liver in this one is about some of the best liver you're ever gonna get. Yeah, the boys just seen another seal over there. I mean William just come uh come here to look, see is there an egg. Uh we couldn't get too too much ice. We couldn't get it where we wanted to uh, get. There's a good place out there. You normally get like an early egg, but so, so we'll just go on this little island here, just for a little walk around, look around, show them what to look for. Just after five, I think. So we're there for like four, no, four, one, three hours. Oh, two minutes, two five. But anyway, I'm gonna skin off that seal and getting in the pot right away. Now, I normally don't wear gloves, but uh, for handling the camera and all that, you know, it was uh, 
lot easier with clean hands. <laughs> so, do to perform a little operation here. <laughs> Tell you now, this meat is going to be fantastic. I don't think there's much blood left in this one. He bled out a lot. Got the pan ready. I'm going to cut it up and put it in the pan right away because it's getting kind of late. First of all, a bit of salt pork. seal meat right there. It's more there look clean there yet. Just look at that liver right there. William's going to give a little taste test for the ring seal liver. Mm. How's it? Good. Yeah. Ring seal liver to me is the best liver out of anything. Absolutely delicious. Well, I just butchered up another ring seal. Not that ring seal, I got two meals, two real nice meals for the boat here. Uh, I also got the heart and liver here. I'm gonna fry that up for a treat this evening. But uh, yeah, you know, those ring seals, uh, just that one seal, you know, just two meals for the boat here. So, you know, they're much smaller. That's why we like to get bigger seals, a lot bigger seals, you know, uh, go, go a lot further. Well, Cook, what's on the menu? Look at that. There's a lot of fish, but it's all under those potatoes. Oh, here, I gotta try a little bit here now. A little bit around there. Oh, they're so good. That is really good. pelted off uh, that uh, harbor seal that uh, Trev shot and then I'm gonna clean up the meat normally we you know we put it in snow you know and then cleaned it up later but there's not much snow around here right now so I'm just gonna clean this right up and put it in the freezer and we'll be enjoying this as we're fishing throughout the summer real good good meat for for when you're working you know well I must say we had a wonderful trip here to Williams Harbor uh, got a bit of work done got a few strings of gear hollowed on the head of the wharf there and the rest, you know, when we come back, uh, when it's time, we'll just uh, haul them right aboard the long liner there. And, you know, we got a few meals of wild game, a few seals and a few birds. Yeah. And I uh, got two pelts right there. One is from uh, the jarred ring seal and the other one is from uh, the harbor seal that Trevor shot there this morning. So I'm going to take them back to Goose Bay and clean, clean them, spread them and dry them. 
and just picking up a few things the young fellas bike and gas cans and stuff and uh, yeah later on once we'll be heading back to port open and then we're going back goose bay tonight your windshield. One fella cleaning up some seal meat and another fella back here cleaning the shoulder. You pop, he's tired now. You pop a hug. Yeah, okay. If you can catch him, you keep him as a pit. I think it'd be hard to catch. <laughs> <laughs> 